I'm planning on replacing the top of my clutch fixture table, which I compared to Harbor Freight's titanium fixture table in a previous video. The link will be in the description and top right of this video right now. I'm going to use the current top as a template to drill out a piece of 5 16 with my Vivor mag drill. And you guessed it, I've got videos of that one too. I ordered a 16 millimeter annular cutter off Amazon and I got a little bit of a surprise and I mean that literally. When I first opened the package, I chuckled because it's labeled as HSS annular cutter 16 inches by one inch. Imagine that for a second. That's an extra large pizza. You could use the slug as a pan. I pulled it out and compared it to the holes on my tabletop and noticed it was a bit of a loose fit. I pretended to be a machinist for a second and I pulled out my El Cheapo digital caliper. I was astounded to see it measured out at 15 millimeters. I know inflation is running rampant, but damn it, I paid for that extra millimeter. I called up Michigan Drill Corporation and demanded to speak to the manager. No, not, not really. I, I sent them an email through Amazon and they double checked their other cutters and sent me out a replacement right away. It arrived via USPS yellow envelope and I carefully inspected it. I now have the 16 millimeter annular cutter of my dreams. And I can't wait to see where it takes me in life. I was so excited, I decided to take it for a test run through a piece of 5 16 flat bar. I'm planning on drilling out 216 of these holes, so I figured it wouldn't hurt to have a little practice run. I'm not using the coolant tank here, so I have to stop and manually add cutting fluid. This slows down the process a lot, but I haven't fabricated my mag drill stand with a drain yet. This should go much faster when I can just run the drill non-stop, or at least that's what I've been telling myself. That's all for this one. My Bauer Chainsaw Review video somewhat flopped in terms of views, so I wanted to get something else out. I'm currently fabricating a floating shelf bracket, but it'll take me a bit to get that one edited. Thanks for watching, and please, please like and subscribe. Thanks guys.